Hi guys, in this video we talk about must do topics in anatomy. These are extremely important in NEET PG 2023. So let's begin. From histology, cartilage types and joint types. All types of cartilage, hyaline cartilage, elastic cartilage and fibrocartilage and all the joint types. This is a picture of hyaline cartilage. Now from upper limb, all the nerves, median nerve, radial nerve, ulnar nerve, musculocutaneous nerve, all the nerves are important. Small muscles of hand, lumbricals, palmar interossi, dorsal interossi, all the small muscles of hands are important. What is this muscle? This is lumbricals. Anatomical snap box, the boundaries. Dermatomal distributions, reflex, root values, extremely important. Brachial plexus, important. Decorvan tenosynovitis, rotator cuff. From lower limb, all the nerves, again important. Great saphenous vein, short saphenous vein, these are important. Iliopubic tract, femoral triangle, hamstring muscles, okay. From thorax, abdomen and perineum, blood supply of stomach, extremely important. Celiac trunk, laser momentum, epiploic foramen, unseenate process anatomy, again important topic. Lymphatic drainage of testis anal canal and cervix, prostate, lobes, uvula vesaiki, median lobe, calotes triangle, cantilis line or cholecysto cover line, again important. Corridor lobe of liver, another important topic. Blood supply of heart, very 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 important. First rib, anatomy. Sipson's fascia, pectoralis major, minor, accents, nerve supply. Another important muscle, levator scapulae. Openings of diaphragm, important topic. Hilum of lung, visceral impressions on lung, kidney, spleen. Hernia, surgical anatomy. Levator anai muscle, azygous venous system. Brachiocephalic vein, pudendal nerve, from head and neck and neuro anatomy, third, fourth, fifth, seventh, ninth cranial nerve. Okay, you have to read all the details. Submandibular gland, especially lingual nerve, submandibular duct, circle of wheels, fornix, corpus callosum, image and connections, internal capsule, fiber types and blood supply. Okay. Medial and lateral medullary syndrome, medial and lateral pontine syndrome, extremely important. Weber syndrome, Broca's area, Wernicke's area, extremely important. Pharyngeal arch derivates, very, very, very important. Especially first, second and sixth pharyngeal arch. Cerebellum, blood supply, histology and connections. This topic is repeated in every year. Basal ganglia parts, nerve column in brainstem, GAC, GVE, SV, etc. Face syndrome. Levels of limb node in neck, nerve supply of external ear, carotid sheath, larynx, muscles, and nerve supply, layers of deep cervical fascia, base of the skull, especially foraminous, tonsil, anatomy, blood supply, nerve supply, okay, thyroid gland, anatomy, blood supply, nerve supply, muscles of mastication, especially temporalis, lateral pterygoid, masseter, very, very important. Embryology, derivatives of ventral and dorsal mesentery, meiosis, from heart development, ductus venosus, ductus arteriosus, foramen ovelli, intraventricular septum development, and overall development of the heart. And another more important topic is ureteric bud. So, this is a short list of all the important topics of anatomy. These are must do topics. You cannot skip a single topic from this list. So look the topics whether you cover it or not. If not, please cover it. So all the best. See you in next video. Tata.